Libra. Welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your weekly general message for November the 10th through November the 17th. Okay, Libra, let's get right into it. Angels, angels, we're looking for all the positive energy that we can for these seven little days. That's it, just seven. All right, angels, let's do some work. Yes, yes, yes four lovely beautiful 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 <laughs> libra okay guys yes that's you too all right angels one more thank you thank you thank you do, 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 do. what's going on angels for libra this seven little day period hmm seven little days that's it angels just seven bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum. Okay. All right, angels. What? I feel like, I feel like, yes, 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 yes. I feel like, hmm, what is going on here with Libra? What is going on here with Libra? Hmm. Bum, 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 bum. Beautiful, beautiful Libra. If this is taking too long, you guys already know what to do, right? Yeah, you already know. Mm -hmm. It's like, yeah, <laughs> it's like, you know, it's kind of like, just do that. <laughs> That's it, just do that, right? It's like, tarot in an instant. It's like microwavable tarot. Okay, what is going on this week? Yes, for beautiful, creative Libra. All right, let's get right into this, okay? The major theme, the major theme for the week, Libra, is the Nine of Pentacles reversed with partnership and alliances, Joker and the Queen of Hearts. What is going on this week? I feel like there's a manner there's a matter of not feeling empowered this week. Definitely, and I feel like this empowerment has to do with your partnerships, your alliances, your friends, your romantic partners, your business partners. There's a matter of not feeling empowered and I feel like this came out of the blue, right? Yes, and I feel like I feel like with this queen of hearts, it's like hmm, I feel like it's why do I feel like you it's kind of like you Oh, you know, <laughs> Libra, I feel like you've had your wall up for a while, right? And I feel like you let your wall down. And yeah, yeah, that's probably, yeah, that's what I'm picking up. So you're not feeling empowered with your partners, your alliances, your friends, your lovers, things of that nature. And it just came from out of the blue because I feel like, yeah, you got very comfortable. Okay. All right. Now let's look in the recent past, the recent past. We have the queen. Yes, yes, yes. The queen of wands reversed with the spiritual growth Libra and the ace of spades and the six of spades. So in the recent past, I feel like the queen of wands is like, like in the recent past, I feel like you were trying to regain um, your power. You were working on regaining your power. You were going through spiritual spiritual growth. You were being very, very strong because you, you felt a little bit powerless. Maybe you were out of control, right? But I feel like you went within and you did the spiritual work. You had, and I feel like, I feel like with the six of spades, it was faded. It was like, you know what? I feel like you've been struggling with your power for quite some time and um, it's a spiritual power. It's a power of getting in control of certain things in your life, right? And I feel like in the recent past, you were doing the work. You were definitely doing the work to regain your power. And this results, you know, it's spiritual work, but it spills over into your... Um, your material world, if you will. Material as in this world, not so much as, you know, my inner work and things of that nature. No, 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 no. It's like my inner work spills out into the world. So if I'm working on myself and I'm and I'm trying to regain my power and I'm working on being more powerful and not giving my power away, then that spills out into, right, that spills out into your world. Now, when we look in the middle of the week, we have the 
the wheel of the wheel of fortune reversed yes 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 moving on the seven the seven of hearts the queen of spades and the ace of diamonds i feel like i feel like i feel like that goes there i feel like things are in the middle of the week i feel like things are i feel like things are suddenly going in the direction Hmm. It's like the opposite direction of where you want to go. Things are going opposite of, of the direction you want it to go, right? And I feel like it's going to give you a, a hint. It's like a hint of moving on, trying to let go. I feel like um, there's, a, there's a matter of the seven of hearts. It's like feeling um, let down, feeling betrayed, feeling like someone didn't have your best interest at heart, right? And this queen of spades, it's like you're doing the inner work you're you're really doing the inner work yes to master i feel like you're mastering this motion this emotion of 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 things not going your way i feel like yeah i feel like it's things aren't going your way and you're really working through those emotions people may be letting you down maybe not be showing up when you want them to maybe not um putting forth effort the way you would like them to. And it, it just feels like emotionally, emotionally, you're, you're doing your best to let it go. You're doing your best to let it go. Now, by the end of the week, Libra, by the end of the week, um, I feel like we need another card here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, so by the end of the week, Libra, you have the moon card reversed. So things are starting to become very, very clear, right? And I feel like you're starting a new beginning. And you know what? A very new beginning by the end of the week with the Ace of Diamonds. I feel like it's a new partnership. It's brand, I feel like it's spanking brand new. I feel like the, um, I feel like whatever it is that's letting you down in the in the middle of the week it's giving you clarity it's it's directing you into i feel like it's directing in you into not the unknown but the known if that makes sense like i knew i knew that i should go this way all the time but i i i, I did it right i did it because i was sitting in a place of of um like kind of giving your power away definitely giving your power away um now let's look into your bonus let's look into your bonus you have the um the five of cups reversed with the two of wands and memories of love the nine of spades and the king of hearts so when i look into yeah your bonus it's like you are now starting to focus on that which is stable in your life yes that which is stable i feel like with the two of wands reversed you not only are you are you focusing on what is not stable you're also looking how you're going to move forward with stability i feel like memories of love i feel like this may have been someone that um oh whoa i feel like the memories of love is it's going to creep up but don't worry because you have the nine of spades you are going to let it go you're going to let those memories of love go and Yes, you will master your emotion. You will master, you become the, I feel like you're getting your power back by the end of the week. I feel like you're getting your power back. But the only way you could get your power back, Libra, is to go through these emotions. Is It's almost like the universe has set it up where, you know, um, you're, you're giving away your power. You're allowing people to... Um, take control of your life, right? I feel like take control of your life. But, you know, it's not a, it's not like a... a um, it, it's kind of like, yes, people are taking control of your life, but I feel like you've been pushing and pulling and pushing and pulling. Like you're trying to regain your power. You're definitely trying to regain your power. And the only way the universe can show you how you regained your power is through an energy that is not there for you. So take a look around. Who is not there for you? Who who is um you know you know you know sometimes people speak with forked tongue, right? Um, they're like um I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna do this, but you feel like well did they really? Well because I feel like I feel like whatever was spoken, whatever guarantee was given, I feel like 
it was not followed through. It was not followed through. And you're definitely ready to, I feel like you're, you're ready to move on from this emotion. Things are very clear, definitely very clear. There's new beginnings this week, new beginnings in partnerships, friendships, um, releasing things that are not stable in your life. You're moving forward. Will those, will those feelings cre creep up? Yes. But this week, you're ready to let them go. You're going to master your power. You are taking your power back, Libra. Kudos to you. This is not a love reading. So apply it to your life as it fits. If it has to do with a job, a family member, a child, an aunt, an uncle, apply it where it fits. If you are a cross watcher, this might be for you. Getting your power back from a Libra. Okay, so I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.